All right, well, I got a request uh, to do a walk around on these two uh, Buicks here. But honestly, nothing's really changed with them uh, since I got them, pretty much. A uh, little background story on them. This green one here was my brother's, uh, and he gave it to me when the transmission went out on it. It's still, it still moves when it's cold, but as soon as it warms up, it's, it won't move. So, yeah, it needs a new transmission, and apparently it has a flat tire. Um, I'm going to keep this one for, for parts, I think. I don't think I'm going to fix it. Um, beat up interior, kind of nasty. Still runs, though, so it's good for parts. And this one here, I got uh, from a buddy of mine. He was going to scrap it out, and I got it with the intention of fixing it up, maybe driving it. But it's got quite a few problems. <clears throat> I fixed some of them, but uh, after a while, the uh, fuel line and the brake line uh, both started leaking on it. They rusted it out. And I could fix those, um, but I'd probably be better off if I was going to fix them, just replace all the lines in it. And that's a, that's a fair bit of work on this rusty thing, so I think for now we'll just leave it as is. Um, I'll keep it for parts for sure, but probably won't uh, actually fix it. As you can see, it's pretty rusty underneath. I mean, the only things I did to fix it were a few little, few little things that were free, like the mirrors I put on. I had those laying around, but as you can see, it's pretty rusty. So the interior is not too bad, but... We'll keep it for parts for now anyway. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and grab a battery while I'm out here and uh, we'll see if we can fire these two up. We'll start with the green one. Alright, we've got a battery in this thing. Let's uh, let's see if it starts. Hopefully the wind isn't too bad, but let's see what happens. Well, she started pretty good, but man, does it smell like mice in there. <coughs> yeah, it just absolutely reeks of mouse in here. I suppose that's what happens when you let them sit out for as long as I have. Got a bit of a whine, but other than that, it's fine. I try to move it, but that tire is flat, so I don't want to mess with it. And here's my <laughs> my brother's awesome radio installation. I don't know if he's still got the subs hooked up in the back or not. Might have to check that out. Well, they're here, and there's an amp. I don't know if it's, no, it's not plugged in at all. Well, it's sort of plugged in. I don't know what these, all these wires are for. Maybe it is. Uh, what have we got in there? Oh yeah, I suppose everything's hooked up. Although I don't, <laughs> I don't really trust it. Yeah, I don't think that's set up to go though. Oh, I suppose that's probably why it stinks so bad. Mice. I hate mice. All right, well, I suppose we should take the battery out of this one and throw it into this uh, tan one here. I'm not sure this one will start because it does have that fuel leak, but uh, we can give her a try anyway. All right, battery's in it. Let's see if this crusty thing will run.
That's one heck of a cloud. <laughs> Once you fire it up, it's a good sign. We can let this one run for a little while because it's, uh, it's got a good transmission. I can't go anywhere though, it's got flat tires. Yeah, I got a little bit of an exhaust leak and it's kind of blowing some crap out of the engine, but it started up pretty dang good. Not going anywhere with that. The interior on this one's uh, much better. Not nearly as bad. And there's the other two Buicks. Pretty much parts. I think they will run. I'm not going to start them up now though because uh, I don't think either of them have gaffs. And then the Granada, that won't get started for a while. I've got to crawl under it and uh, figure out that fuel pump. It's not working again. It's probably just that, that temporary wire I ran to get it to, to fire last time. I'll probably uh, go for his 8 through it again or something. So I'll have to crawl under that sometime when it's warm out and uh, see if I can get that one running. But yeah, the, that's the Buicks here. 250000 on this one, just about. And I don't remember how much is on this other one. Got to burn off some of that oil. Yeah, 182 on this one. That ain't too bad. God, that one just smells like mice horrible. I suppose I should shut this down because the gas is probably pissing out the back pretty good now. With that fuel line leak. leaking from but down back here somewhere it was pretty wet last time I looked at it so we'll shut her down don't want to burn burn my car to the ground or nothing well that went pretty well they both started pretty good